What's up, everybody? It's the homie Truth Teller, the street reporter. And today's hood question is going to be a question that a lot of people want to know. And that's the reason why O Block and 600 and 300 and all those guys, the reason why those guys turned on Tay 600. And like I said in earlier blocks, I wasn't there. I'm not sure. I could just give my expert opinion. You believe me? You feel me? Uh, I just believe that, unfortunately, we know the news broke that Tay 600 was there. You know, I just believe the fact that it was three guys there, okay? Three guys interrogated by the police, okay? You following me? And uh, unfortunately, only two guys were charged with a murder and sentenced to a long time in jail. I just think that kind of looks a little fishy. And I think that's what those guys ran with, you know what I'm saying? And I just believe that the love for Rondo and C-Day is so strong that a lot of people turned on Tay 600. I believe social media and the internet help hype a lot of that shit up too, if you ask me. I think that kind of put the fuel to the fires. Uh, I think it was already a lit situation, sort of like matches on the table. You know what I'm saying? But I think the internet kind of struck the matches. You get what I'm saying? It set the shit ablaze, if you ask me. Uh, nobody actually apologized to this guy yet because no paperwork came out proving this guy snitch or uh, any of that shit. Even Lil Dirk, uh, Lil Reese and them, you know, they being old block cool and this shit. They actually called that man a snitch and shit like that. We know it was rumors that Tay 600 used to fuck with Dirk Baby Mama. I'm not sure. I couldn't verify that. But I just feel like it's crazy that that um that whole gang of rappers kind of turned on Tay 600 and they had a lot of clout which made a lot of fans turn on them too you know uh in chicago is a dangerous place so being known as a snitch is very dangerous it's almost like being a rapist in jail you know the shit kind of go together if you ask me and the fact that uh everybody wasn't going along with that shit kind of showed that Tay 600 got a co-following the fact that he did a lot of downloads on my mixtapes uh shows everybody's not against him you know i do believe that since the paperwork went now maybe somebody would have said my bad or stepped up and said hey we can't be calling the man a snitch unless we have proof but the shit never happened so i just believe that's the reason why those guys turned on them it's simple you know three guys got questioned two people went to jail one didn't it just seemed unbelievable that you was just set free but if we don't got no paperwork to prove it you can't really say that leave me a comment let me know what y'all think of this it's the homie